How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to create your own custom ringtones on the iPhone using a program called, uh, excuse me, using an app called Ringtone Designer. And I'm in the App Store right now. There's actually two versions of it. There's a free version and there's a paid version. Um, the paid version is 99 cents. Uh, and what you get on the paid version, you don't get on the free version, is you can actually record your own custom sound and then turn it into a ringtone or a text message tone or a tone if someone emails you. On the uh, free version, you can't do that. So I'm going to be using the paid version. It's 99 cents. up to you which one you want to choose. Um, but everything else in the video will be the same it'll work for both apps okay so I'm gonna go back to my home screen I'm gonna open up the app uh, ringtone um, ringtone maker or excuse me ringtone designer we're gonna tap on the music icon I'm gonna pick a song I'm gonna pick a song by a friend of mine which I know is in copyright so I could use the music um, let's see Let's use the song, So Good. So, uh, as soon as you open the app and you pull the song in, it's going to ask you if you want to make a ringtone or a text tone. Let's start with a ringtone first. And pretty much, um, you use this part right here to... Move it a little bit there. We're going to use uh, this part to uh, move in forward and backward to the song to find that point that we want to choose for the ringtone so if, if I hit play wherever this is it's going to start it okay so let's pull this back and I want to get this all the way to the beginning I'm just going to use the uh, couple seconds of the beginning so let's uh, go ahead and hit play so wherever this is it'll uh, you know that's where the your section will record so if I move this, if I move over right here, it'll change the part of it. Okay, so I'm just gonna just make the beginning the ringtone just to make it real simple. And you can actually go in and customize it however you want it uh, with the app. It lets you do a lot, and you can change the length of how long it is. But let's just see how far this part is right now. And it'll only play up to here, and then it'll stop, and that'll be the part that becomes the ringtone. Um, and up here it shows you how many seconds is selected. So right now I'm on 21 seconds. Okay. So that was actually a perfect section right there. So let's say if you know that's the part you want, um, we'll make that the ringtone. And all you have to do is press uh, save. And now it's gonna save it. It's gonna create a ringtone. It's gonna save it. Now. In order to get it onto the, to, in order to make it an actual ringtone on your phone, you do have to plug in your iPhone to your computer, and there's a couple of things you have to do on there, and then uh, it puts it in the right place. But um, we have our ringtone. We're gonna create a text tone real quick, and then we're gonna go to the computer. So now let's go to music, and in fact, I'm gonna show you the recording part. Uh, if we hit a uh, little microphone right here, I can actually record something and then make it my uh, text tone. So I'm going to record myself real quick. Hey, hey! A little, a little corny, you know, crusty from uh, Simpsons. It'll do for right now. I'm going to hit text tone. Okay, and then I'm going to drag this guy all the way back. And just, this is going to be between the music section. Just hit play right here. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. So I'm going to adjust it a little bit, obviously, because it's getting the part where I'm breathing. I don't want that part to be in there. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. And that's, uh. Hey, hey. That's our text tone, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and hit save. And it's successfully saved. So that's the first step. You create the ringtone on the phone. All right, so this is step two right here. We need to plug in the iPhone or iPod Touch into the computer. And under devices, you should see the name of your uh, iPhone. Mine, I have mine named right hand man, so that's why it says that right here. Um, so first thing you want to do is uh, go ahead and sync your iPad. Um, 
so it'll actually transfer what's ever on your iPhone to the computer so hit sync go ahead and do that first this takes a few minutes so I'm gonna let that uh, do the sync and then come back and then show you what you have to do because uh, basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna move the ringtone from the phone to the computer and then we throw it back into iTunes and then we sync it where the ringtone section is and then we're good to go so I'm gonna show you that right now so I'll be back in one sec okay after your uh, computer finishes syncing what you want to do is you want to come to where it says apps which is right here and uh, once you go to apps your computer should switch over to this screen right here and you want to scroll down all the way to the bottom and you want to find the little icon that says ringtones looks just like the app and then it'll show all the ringtones that um, that you created I've created a whole bunch of different ones um, so I'm just gonna look for the ones that say today that's how I know which ones I just did so I'm gonna click on the one from today this is one of them and I'm gonna uh, press save to just right there and I'm gonna save it to the desktop what you want to do is on the left side over here click on desktop and then hit um, select folder okay and then um, I did one more that was also it says today so I'm also gonna hit save to and it already says desktop so I'm gonna hit select folder and then I'm gonna hit um, Oh, so now what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and uh, kind of shrink this window down a little bit. Let's put it right here. And uh, here are the two files that we just uh, saved. Okay, I saved them to the desktop. And simply all we have to do now is take the file and click and hold your mouse and drag it back into iTunes right here. And then this one right here, I'm going to click and drag it into iTunes. And um, basically... Um, the app uh, saves it in the ringtone format so you don't have to do any type of conversion all you do is when you throw it back into iTunes it actually puts it in the right section for you so now come up to where it says tones click on tones and make sure uh, sync tones is uh, selected right here and then we're going to hit apply which is right here and now it's going to go ahead and synchronize uh, those two uh, tones that we just threw back in so we're going to wait for that to finish and once that's done um, you know what it's done already that was super quick so we're going to hit OK and now we're going to move on to step 3 alright so now we're at step 3 right here we're going to go back to the iPhone and uh, what you want to do is you want to find your settings icon go to settings Okay. Then you want to go to sounds, and uh, I'm going to go to where it says ringtone, and now, let's see, one of the ones I created today was uh, So Good, which is right here, so I'm going to just tap on it, and then listen. So remember, that was the one that we created at the beginning, so now that it's checked, if anyone calls me, that's going to be my ringtone, okay, it's going to be right in this section. And then now, go to text tone, and I'm going to come all the way down, and I'm going to find the one I created. Uh, and um, if you recorded like your own custom sound, then it's going to be under my recording, and it should be this third one right here. Hey, hey! There it is. Okay, so now that's selected. Um, and what you can also do is come down to... Uh, new tweet calendar alert um, you can change all these different sounds you can create excuse me your own custom sounds for all these okay I'm gonna particularly do it for new mail actually not sent mail but new mail and I'm gonna send myself a message right now so you can actually hear it work hey hey so I've just selected that and watch this hey hey and there it is and that's simple um, it has uh, made it a text tone or a message tone and so um, this is a cool app so feel free to you know take all your songs or record some cool stuff I actually recorded um, the song from coming to America when he sings listen to this
I actually recorded that and uh, made that my ringtone for a little while. So I actually put the movie on, held the phone up to the TV, and recorded it and made it my ringtone. So this is the program you use or the app that you use to create your own custom ringtones. Have some fun. Get the 99 cent version so you can record all kind of cool sounds. You can even record your friends acting silly and make it your ringtone as a joke, whatever. But, um, you know, really simple process, and it's one of my favorite apps because... Uh, now I can customize my stuff. So hope that was helpful. Leave a comment in the bottom. Uh, like me on Facebook, um, facebook.com slash h2techvideos. And uh, have a good one.